boy. Okay, here we go. What? Where'd you come from? Okay, no. Mm -mm. Sorry, it's not ain't gonna happen because this is my spot. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go in there. Okay, me. No, 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 no. No, stop. You, no, me, me. I got here first. Oh, yeah? Okay, well, you're gonna be here last. <laughs> Princess in the flesh. <laughs> Ever have one of these days? <laughs> Hi, I'm Philip P. Nolte. I'm a doctor and founder of the Institute of Awkward Awareness, where we have been researching awkwardity since 1992. Welcome to Anatomy of a Socially Awkward Situation. Human problem solving has come a long way since the crude social tactics of our primitive ancestors. But despite evolution, our animal instincts are never far away. The top three triggers are hunger, procreation, road rage. Evidence of road rage can be seen in perspiration at the temples and dilation of the lower nostril cortex. Its intensity tends to correlate to the security we feel in the steel womb of our vehicles. How's Rebecca gonna get out of this one? Let's watch, listen, and learn. This friendly. Oh, hi. Hi, hi, hi. I am so sorry. You would not believe the morning I had. My boyfriend broke up with me. I, I'll tell uh, you what. Mm -hmm. Do you want this job? More than anything. <clears throat> Are you willing to take a one-year commitment? On my mother's life. Mom? No, I'm great, yeah. This is, I couldn't be happier. <laughs> How are you feeling? Rebecca has just demonstrated the classic victim dictum. Once you make an excuse, you volunteered yourself for abuse. Be careful with this dictum, as it will come back to slap you in the face. After all, in the game of evolution, it's never the victims who win. Hopefully, it's time for the final solution. Best friendly. Oh, hi. hi. Hi, hi, hi. Rebecca Tanner, a pleasure. Beautiful ficus. Oh, oh is this some kind of joke? No, you just this th is an interview that started 10 minutes ago. Look, the marketplace is more competitive now more than ever. I knew that was you outside. Yeah, I could have introduced myself in plated resume and hand said, go get her, self-starter, team player, blah, blah, blah. But you seem smarter than that. Am I right? I'm right. So could you just give me like some exact details on how much time I'd be spending in South America just so I can... Um, no, there is no South American position. Excuse me? Oh, it looks like someone forgot to dot some I's and cross some T's. So I'm just gonna have to retract my application, but I thank you so much for your time, and I will probably be seeing you later on. Maybe I would interview you, would that be funny? <laughs> okay, well, bye-bye. Uh, Julie, do we still have that lobbyist position open? Go get him, Tiger. Until next time, I'm Dr. Philip P. Nolte, helping you turn awkwardity into opportunity.